One of our goals is to innovate and to promote the art form of circus. Uh, the key way in which we do that is to create original contemporary circus shows for young and family audiences that we tour around Australia and around the world. This morning we have been doing some mindful drawings of some amazing cities and some of those cities look a little bit circus-like. So we have our own academic school. What that allows us to do is to use circus as the basis for an all-round education uh, and a creative environment and a really amazing journey that we take young people on. Our job is to make sure they get a broad education and it's grounded and it's well balanced. And it's very much student orientated, it's very much directed around fitting in the curriculum in terms of what their needs are in the training schedule. These kids are at the top of the game. Our aspiration is that they are performance ready, so that they are ready to join an ensemble with Cirque du Soleil, if that's what they choose, or Circus Oz, or, or some of the indie companies. Two of our students who are due to graduate this year have been offered contracts with Cirque du Soleil. Harry is going to join a, a new teeterboard training program in Montreal and his teeterboard partner, Cooper, is going straight from here to Las Vegas. So all be to Las Vegas. I performed a lot myself, so, and I definitely know that this is what I want to do for a career. Got to work hard for it and super excited for the next chapter. I started when I was four at the early program. Came in and loved it ever since and always grown up watching Cirque du Soleil, all their teeterboard acts, and now like I have the chance to be doing it. It's pretty amazing and surreal. We get to see where they go and how they develop as an artist, and it's incredible. I'm very inspired by how they've moved on. Me and my brother moved down here a year ago to do Fruities, and it was so good. Like, the benefits are amazing. One of the things I'm really passionate about is giving the responsibility to shape the art form to them, making them responsible, inspirational artists who are self-directed and self-initiating and who make the art that they want to make. Australia is absolutely a world leader in circus. My job is always to make sure that we're doing everything that we can to give these young people who turn from children, to young adults under our roof and then into emerging artists to make a successful career as a performer and potentially as, you know, our next cultural leaders.